Let's go get our boy, shall we? I'm going to turn the light on first. Right out the gate, I can tell you we got a real good chance for Tagila here based off what we're hearing. So, yeah. Oh, that feels... Dude, coming back to that after being on, like... MP5s with iron sights and, and bolties and shit. Uh, I know people are like, man, why are you using these dumbass guns? I'm going to have to answer that question until I die. Probably. Why do you start your PvP wipes like that? Um, reasons. So yeah, um, we got some real action going on over here. Are we on full auto? We are. Hello there. Um, uh, people? Mr. Scary Boss Person? Are you already over here killing people? I feel like that's what's happening. Oh, we got gunshots coming from the top side. Yeah, dude. There's some wildness going on right now, and that guy's dead. Um, I'm not sure if Tequila was down there, but it definitely sounded like... You are not shooting that grenade at me. Another reason I don't like the flashlight is because when you're ADS like that, I believe it actually gets in the way more than it helps in terms of you being able to see what you're aiming at. So I'm going to keep it on for uh, for the sake of everyone at home, but um, it's just not my favorite attachment outside of trying to make sure you guys can see everything. little repack here and we'll keep it moving boy oh boy eight people in the stream and we've had a good number like that all day you guys are amazing man thank you so much for being here um we're gonna get repacked and head through factory see if we can find our boy here it's all about bossing on pve today and so it's gonna be nice to uh to just kind of settle into that type of rating after uh scrimping and saving on on pvp um, not that I mind that. I actually enjoy the come up, man. Oh, yep, our boy's here. So we need to run. Run! Run. I tried to spray legs there, but we know he's here. So what we can do is we know we hit him, right? What we don't know is where he's running to. Did we? No way we put him down. Right there, right? No. You don't see nothing. Shut up. You need to pay attention to Tequila, man. Is what you need to pay attention to. Not to me, asshole. We got bigger problems. You think I'm the issue? You've never been to factory before. Clearly. Bruh. We got bigger problems and I can hear him. Where is he? Alright, so yeah, let's take the safe play. <laughs> I need to reposition. I don't know where Tagila is. I'm not sure if I killed that guy. Oh. I know, man. Listen. Did that hurt? Yeah, come on. Let's go, Tagila down. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, the spear. Oh, it feels so good to have this gun back in my hands. I appreciate you guys hanging with me through all the bolty shenanigans. But that's just how I start my PvP wipe. So there you go. We need to reload though. And uh, I probably need to get to his body before someone else does. Right? I feel like that would be a good thing. Maybe. <laughs> so many empty mags. Tagila's dead, man. That's awesome. Alright. Back to Grizzlies too. And serve kits. And so yeah, the world is feeling pretty good right now. I am glad we did the PvE stream. Or PvP first, I think. That was the right move. Just because... For me, they're like two totally different experiences. I come to PvE to have fun, settle in, have good gunfights, um, try out all the different weapons, blah, blah, blah. PvP for me is legit. Like, that's the uh, the be careful military set. You know, that that's the one that's just like, man, um, now it's real. You know, that's how I feel about it. Uh, I play that when I want that tense kind of moment-to-moment, -moment, oh shit, feeling. But some days you come home and you just don't want that. And that's where I think PvE has kind of filled a gap for a lot of folks. But at the same time, um, I think there's some folks out there that maybe just don't understand why people like it. But that's it. So we got tier 6 plates here. We're going to grab that. Um, and honestly, I could just leave them in there and grab that. That's probably the smarter play. But we definitely want to get out with those. 
Uh, tier 6 plates are amazing. So uh, we're not going to stay too exposed here, but I do want to repack. We got um, most of what's important off our boy. We'll take his cap. We can sell that later. I'm not really too concerned about the rest of these guys. So yeah, it's a Boston kind of day for me, actually. Um, so what we should do, rather than worry about any of the rest of it, let's just reset and hit another factory and see if we can get another Tagilla, right? Because that's what you do when you boss. <laughs> you get the win, you head out, and then you go back again, right? So we're going to get reset here, see if we can get us another Tagilla, but real quick, we got one out of the way, and we got some tier 6 plates to show, f or no, we got one tier 6 plate, that's a tier 4. You cheap son of a bitch, y'all already know what I was about to say, right? <laughs> uh, I didn't know you could spawn out here. Like, I love this place, but I didn't know that was a thing. Okay. So I don't hear a lot of shenanigans so far, so maybe we don't have a tequila here. And if that's the case, you know... We're not gonna just gonna. Ooh, maybe I'm wrong. Actually, <laughs> maybe I spoke too soon. We're not just gonna reset. Um, if Tegilla's not here and it's factory, we're just gonna clear every every bit of aggro we can. Holy crap! These guys are going nuts over here right now. We're gonna clear all the aggro we can. Reset and do it again. Oh shit! Yeah. Being out here right now with everything we're hearing is pretty stupid. Let me not do that. Right, because that guy was trying to creep on us, and he's dead. These AI, man, I'm telling y'all. I keep telling people they're making updates. They're getting better. <laughs> you know? Um, it's just, it's happening. I see it every time I log in, man. They do different things. We definitely had a boss or some PMCs or something over here. See what this guy had real quick. We'll repack and then we'll go over there. There was definitely another PMC over there and maybe the boss, but it's also possible that they've killed one another at this point because of all the gunfire we heard. So, Mr. Takeda, thank you, sir. Appreciate your contribution. Uh, we're going to get the rest of this stuff over and uh, see what else he has. We need the extra nades, though, because our box is absolutely empty. And that's actually, I mean, that's, you know, <laughs> that was killer. We were hunting uh, Tagilla's brother the other night, and we came away with a couple wins, but yeah, that's where all our grenades went. Um, yeah, let's get those mags. I don't know. What ammo do you have in here, my dude? Ooh. Ooh. Yes. Don't mind if we do, actually. Let's get that over here, because that ammo is nasty. Alright, and he's full. Oh, <laughs> dude. Uh, you know, we got spear. No, Tagilla's up. Alright, tell you what, if we kill Tagilla, we're going to take that gun for a test drive. Just because I want to see what that ammo feels like. A lot of times I save the high tier ammo and never get around to using it myself. But when I go on boss fights, or boss hunts rather. Oh, he's dead. Damn it. Those guys got to him. Okay, well, whatever. They didn't get a chance to loot him, though. So, let's see what he's got. Well, that's a... Uh, that's unfortunate. Oh, 206. Come on, man. That's what's in your pocket? Really? Can we get a... Maybe we get a plate out of this. If nothing else. Get an L1. Some grenades. Okay, what is in here? Tier 6. Yep, we'll take that. Um, easy Tier 6 plates from your boy Tagilla. And he does drop them consistently. So uh, this stuff actually vendors pretty well. So we're just gonna go ahead and take it. And yeah, with that, I think we reset, get another factory spawn. We know we can't get to Gila. These guys unfortunately killed each other. Um, so there goes our chance. But yeah, that. Oh, you're done. It doesn't sound like it. I mean, it sounds like you're still not done, and that we may need to finish you. That's kind of my assessment of the situation. Just so you know. Where are you, though? Oh, we got some blood in here. Is he downstairs? Oh, we got more PMCs down here. Jeez. They had the firefight of the century today, didn't they? 
Oh, you know what? I've got marker quests to place markers on heat exchangers here. I need to get markers um, when we load out, and we'll bring them back. Um, if you see one of these, double check that. Sometimes you can have tier 6 plates. We get tier 5 there, but that's a solid piece. If you're looking for good armor and you're not sure which one to use, that's a piece I can highly recommend. It's you know it's going to restrict your movement somewhat. Any heavy armor does, but very solid piece right there. We're just not grabbing it because I have enough. But yeah, I do feel like we should get some markers though. And there was a guy who clearly is around, but um. I'm not going to spend a ton of time chasing him down. We should just get reset and get another boss going. We will take that, though. And I want that. Um, bye bye. <laughs> oh, it's so good to have my gun back, y'all. <laughs> I don't understand. I've spent so much time on this gun. I'm not upset about that, but it does make a difference how much time you spend with a firearm, I'm telling you. Um, it just does. You get used to the feel, to the flow, to the swing, to the ADS, like all of it just becomes, in my opinion, easier the more time you spend with a weapon. I'm not really worried about what these guys have here, honestly. We should probably just go. But we'll search him real quick, because maybe he's got something in this backpack here that we could find some use for. I will take the grenades, because our box is empty, and that scope... Mm, no. Alright, we're good. I know, man. Buena na pues. I say that all the time, but not really, because I don't even know what it means. But I just wanted you to feel like we could relate on that point, but we can't, because I've got places to go... I need to reset and come back and kill your boss. And we're not even the same, you know, I mean, you're a scav, I'm a PMC. It just wouldn't work out between us, man. I'm sorry. <laughs> feel free to check with my scavy scav. He'll feel differently. <laughs> Let's get loaded out and get reset for another raid. Oh, uh, man, they took our Tagilla kill, y'all. That's unfortunate. Um, But still a fun raid. Like, we got loaded there, dude. Loaded. And some good action, I feel like. Speaking of good action, I need to get action on this food. <laughs> um, yeah, it'll be here at some point. All right. 4K, Usex Scav, Bear Bear Scav, blah. All right, bam. We're just going to move on past that. And so far, um, one for two raids for our Tagilla kills. Not because he wasn't there, but just because someone else got to him first. Or rather, it looks like they got to each other. I'm not sure anyone survived that firefight. <laughs> they were just, uh, they were going in on each other there in Factory, weren't they? They were going absolutely nuts, man. Nuts, I tell you. He's here, I can hear the running already. He's here and he's aggroed to someone. Maybe even us. I don't want anyone taking our kill. So if you hear that, peek out here because you can see downstairs from here sometimes. Especially if your boy Tagilla is aggroed to someone else. He's coming up. Someone's. Dude, it sounded like someone was climbing up here. Oh, they're going in over there. Please don't kill my boss. You. Man, we gotta get over there. Holy crap, they're just going nuts. I don't think we're gonna make it over there in time. I don't even know where I'm going. Ugh. I know if I try to jump from here, I'm gonna break my legs. I learned that lesson when I was doing that quest, so let's just take the safe way down. What? I heard someone. Fuck you. No. We're not ending this raid that way, because I said so. Ouch! You son of a bitch. Dude, if you broke my arm and I'm trying to get to Tequila, why are these scavs so mean to me, y'all? Like, come on. Obviously, our boy's up over there, and this dude thinks we got time for a broken and 
blacked arm. Obviously, we don't have time for that. You know, <laughs> I ain't got time for that. What is this guy thinking, man? Let me get this serve kick going. Ugh. Jeez. Jeez, jeez, jeez. Get that back that way. All right. Okay, so finish surgery. And we'll... If you need to heal several body parts, by the way, quick way you can do it if you need to repack mags to get the heal started, watch your health, grab a separate stack of ammo, and when you stop seeing your health go up, go ahead and drop it. It'll stop the heal animation, and you can actually start reloading your mag. Start the heal again as soon as you can, and then rinse and repeat. All of a sudden, before you know it, your mags are packed, and you're back to full health again in all of the random body parts that needed it. And it's just a quicker way to get there. Very, very useful in PvE when you're getting swarmed from five different directions. Um, it can absolutely be a lifesaver. So try it out sometime. Have two different types, two different stacks of ammo though, and you switch and alternate back and forth between the two. So very, very useful. I don't hear a lot of gunfire now, so whatever happened over there, pretty sure it's already been settled, but. Could be that Tagilla took them all out, and then uh, we're going to run into him when we get over there. So this was a scav. Wow, you were just over here with a shotgun, right? <laughs> Ready to just shoot us in the face, bro? Ugh. I'm going to slow roll this. We heard a lot of gunfights. No reason for us to... To rush through because if we run across to Gila or he even gets a scent that we're around, we'll know. And then we need to be ready to reposition. Basically. But we know he was here, so if they killed him if his body will be here somewhere. I don't think they would have looted it. The doorbell is the food I ordered, but um, not right now. <laughs> like, listen. Oh, shit. Where? Oh, I believe that's him. Nope. No grenade for you. No grenade for me either, actually. I'm going to run and put my arm back on and listen real quick, because, yeah. So, yeah, that food I ordered. Sorry, that's the doorbell. <laughs> But it's going to sit there, no worries, just so you understand why the doorbell went off. Um, that is what that sound was. Apologies. Alright. So I'm not sure. Doesn't sound like Tagilla's up still, based off what we just heard right there. I really feel like if he was up, he's been killed. And what's left up there is some kind of PMC scav combination, so we'll see what we're dealing with once we get ready here. At this point, I am going to turn off the light, though. Sorry. That's why. Because they're so creepers. Did you guys see him right there? They're creepers, man. No. No way an AI PMC's over here with that happening. Where were you, dude? You must have been in that doorway. Like, how... Here. Chew on that for a sec. I gotta think about our relationship. I'll get back to you. Because I feel like... You don't understand me anymore. You know what I mean? Oh. You feel it now, don't you? I can I can tell. That grenade. It just it just it, it hurt your feelings a little, didn't it? Where's your boss, dude? Matter of fact, where is your boss? Do I wanna check your pockets? Maybe I should. What do you have for us? What can we expect to gain from this interaction? This guy, sure, that guy, absolutely. Hmm. Not much more than that, but that's enough. 
We keep getting just tapped when I walk through this door from over. The oh, up top. Is that our boy? And did we just deuce him? Was that Tagilla? Oh, someone just got wrecked up there. We need to go check that. So if you don't know, that's on top of uh, the little manager's office thing. So, oh, someone just kicked open a door. You mad, bro? Oh, that might have been Tagilla. If we did kill Tagilla, the scavs will rush us. So, maybe that's what's going on here. I don't know. Or maybe they just want to go up and try to loot that body we just created. In which case, that's our loot. And you can keep your scavy mitts off of it, my bro. Let me turn this light back on. I do think that was Tagilla. Or at least a PMC. So, I'm not going to let some scav get that loot because no... Whatever it was, that loot is ours. Right? Right. Glad that's been decided. Let's head over here and see what we got. Please tell me it was Tagilla. Where's the blood on the wall? That'll tell us. Oh, no. You. So did you kill Tagilla then? Somewhere, I, I, I really feel like he was up this round. And if he is, I do want to at least check for his body because... Bosses can spawn key cards, and so it's always useful to check their pockets. Uh, because you never know what treasures await. Plus, if he's got tier 6 plates, given that we can't buy those anymore on either version of the game, I tend to grab those when I can. So, um, yeah, AK-12, solid weapon. I was not a fan when I was working through the test drive quest, but let me go ahead and tell you, if you take off the suppressor, that gun is nasty. And I do use it quite a bit um, after the episode you're currently seeing. I know you're hearing me bitch a lot about the scope right now, but that's a good gun. Don't give up on it. And uh, yeah, all the stuff I'm saying on the episodes, like that's just, I was learning, man. <laughs> I didn't know half of what I was talking about, but some of it is real. You know, the, the goons, 100% spawn shit, we all know that's, ha that's happening. Lightkeeper quest line, broken AF. Worth doing, yes, but expect some frustration for sure. And I did not hide it in the videos, so it's all there for you guys to see. But, um, yeah, some of that stuff, like I, the AK-12, that, that test drive quest was good because it introduced me to the weapon. I wish it would have introduced me to the weapon with a bit of a better overswing so it wasn't blacked out because that's really ADS times important to me. Um, but once I finished the quest, I took that suppressor off and that'll happen in some of the epi episodes you guys will see. I'm saying all this because I don't want you guys hearing me bitch about a gun and then thinking it's not viable. That is an absolutely viable weapon. It's a good gun actually. And after taking the suppressor off, it's quickly become one of my favorite AKs. It's, it's good. Well, really any AK is good in my opinion. All right. So yeah, I know. Well, you pushed us, man. I'm just here looking for Tagilla. Matter of fact, let's check the safe and see if we can go find Tagilla's body. I'm getting distracted here, but I guarantee that dude killed him. And all of a sudden now, um, we don't have a Tagilla to kill because of that. You know, he uh, he took our chance. And I guess if he took our chance for the kill, I just want to see if maybe we can at least get the loot. we got ten minutes to figure it out. So now or never, right? I feel like we just follow the trail of bodies over here on the other side. As long as we don't run into any more PMCs. We know that all the action initially was over here, so let's go see exactly what was happening. Um, our boy was posted up on the back wall over there, and every time we tried to step in this room, he was shooting us. So if anyone took out Tagilla or had a chance to, it would have been him because he had a decent position and a serviceable weapon. But I do believe there's a body here that I'm very interested to find. I'm not going to spend too, too much time on it, but I do want to check around at least to make sure that our boy Tequila's body isn't around. And I'm seeing so many PMCs here now. It may be that it was just PMCs, but 
Till I verify that. Hmm. Okay. Huh. I do not see a Tagella body. Okay. Scavs. There's some scav on scav violence here. Oh, you know what we didn't get? I didn't get markers, man. I need to get markers next time. Okay, I'm satisfied. I don't feel like there was a Tagilla here, maybe. Maybe it is just a million PMCs. But look, man, they're everywhere. <laughs> Thought I heard something, but... Just my PMC bitching about his stamina, as usual. Fine, dude, we'll crawl. Will that make you feel better? Is this what you want? Just to crawl across the factory floor? See, you're not even moving, bro. You know, that's not gonna work. Gotta move. So we get to extract and reset here. Quick depot, but yeah. I uh, I thought we had a, at least a shot at Tegula here, but it seems like the PMCs had other plans. They just clearly hate one another. And I've never thought about actually talking through things. You know, they're so... They're so weird. <laughs> Uh, Alright, let's get out of raid and get back in. If you're in the stream, thank you for being here. If you're watching the episode, same to you. Uh, my ridiculousness continues, as I'm sure you'll know by now. And uh, I don't know that that's ever going to change. But I do appreciate the fact that you guys seem to at least tolerate that. As far as the episode goes, we got a few more raids in us. So hang tight. If you're in the stream, hang tight as well. What is the... Um, the most recent Nintendo, um, the Switch, both there and on PC, because I played on the Switch with my with my kids, and then I played on PC um, when I wasn't playing with them. So yeah, love that game. Enjoy it, my dude. And uh, if you need some help sometime, <laughs> let me know. I uh, I'm pretty handy with a great sword. I'll say that. We got some PMC action over here. You see me, but I don't see you. Bad guy over there. I feel the same way, but you're the bad guy in my story, my dude. I feel like your story might be wrong. Yo, you threw a grenade too. Of course you did. Well, I threw one too, and I got a little friend myself. So are you up here with some other friends, or are you just talking shit about your gun or some shit? Do you have actual friends? I wonder. Like, I don't mean that in a bad way. <laughs> or maybe I do. Do you have... A you seem like... A person who wouldn't make a lot of friends. At least the way you're talking to me right now. I don't know that that's the way I would want to introduce myself if I was trying to make friends. I feel like that wouldn't be the way to do it. Just uh, some feedback, my dude. Let's get a reload going here. <laughs> Take his gun. You know, you just sometimes... You gotta be careful running your mouth in this world. You never know. You never know. <laughs> Oh, we got, uh, let's get these nades and move. Oh, it's a lot of movement, I feel like. I need to move. Really? Is he dead? I don't know if he's dead. Are you dead, my dude? I feel like he's dead. I feel like I also want to verify that fact just to make sure. Did you die? Yeah, the spear is nasty, y'all. Oh, such a good gun. Such a good gun. I don't think we have Tagila here, though, so I think the right thing to do here is to kill whatever we see and then maybe hit a reset. Get repacked, but yeah. I feel like if he was here, we would have heard... A little more action by now, for sure. But, I've felt that way before, and then you turn the wrong corner, and some murderous guy starts rampaging towards you with a sledgehammer. You know, I mean, he can be sleeking around down here. I forgot to get markers again. Ugh. Why do you guys even put up with me? <laughs> Jeez. Oh, wow. Why are you shooting me, bro? And where are you? Okay. We're doing this. The whole sneaky shoot-at-you thing. 
What's going on? What's, what's, what's the deal today? Oh, you guys wanted to uh, stop by and say hello. Are you trying to peek me, man? Was that really an attempt at a peek? It was, I feel like. And now you're pushing while I can hear you unable to breathe? No, you're not pushing. You're just over there dying, aren't you? Oh, no, you're over here dying. Positional audio, like, for real. Where did this guy go to die? He didn't go over there to die. He was trying to creep on us. He dropped down and swung around, you guys. Did you see that? The AI went down through here and came around the ramp to try to creep on us. That is some extra level shit. I love it, but um, just heads up on that. The AI is getting better day by day. And a lot of people are talking about it now. I've been talking about it for at least a month now. The videos are there. <laughs> Right. Yeah. Shut. Listen, man. I'm trying to talk to people. Where are you? Oh. Are you pushing me from over here? You see, we got the light on, right? This is what I'm telling you. You run around with the light on, and you are absolutely advertising your presence. I don't mind, cause spear, right? But for you guys, if you were trying to get in and not draw attention to yourself, turn your light off. Alright, let's reset this because there's clearly no Tagilla here and we're just going to be spammed by scavs and I will check this safe before we go though because loot. But yeah. Uh, I think three clips is good enough and we can just load the rest on extract. It'll be fine. So we'll take the win, no Tagilla this time, but it is factory, and that's just the way it goes. And what we may do as we go through this, you know, we get into, you know, a situation where we're loading in over and over and we just don't have a boss spawn. We'll just cycle out and go to a different map just to keep things interesting for everyone. But we're on factory now, hunting Tagilla. We got one kill out of maybe four raids now. We saw him twice, but the PMCs took him once, and that's not an extract. Why is there gunfire now? Now that makes me curious. Probably a PMC, but I'm going to run and check that out real quick, guys. Sorry, I know we were close to extract, but if he is here, I don't want to miss the opportunity. Oh! <laughs> so it wasn't to kill him. Oh man, I should have peeked that door a little better, a little better, a little safer. But we didn't, and so now we're dead. <laughs> Where's the music, man? There we go. Okay, yep. Fill my ears with disappointment. Let's go. So anyway, that happened. If you're watching the episode, I think we'll... We'll stop it at C banana rivers. Banana nan banana nana bananas. Bananas. We'll stop it there. I'll let you guys off the hook. We'll get re -geared. Thank you so much for stopping by. <laughs> it's your boy Con4 with Fox Nest Gaming. Man, y'all take care of one another and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.